Attention all current and future artists, there's a new place for you to work on your next masterpiece and meet up with other area creators. Plus, it's in the perfect location. One of the area's national historical landmarks, the Roy Croft Campus in East Aurora. Mike Randall reports. Barbara Castilla is an artist. That's one of her watercolors hanging at the Roy Croft Campus New Art Center. I have been painting for, I don't know, somewhere between 40 and 50 years. Barbara has a special place in her heart for artists. She thought if other towns have art centers, why not East Aurora? The Arts and Crafts Movement was born, East Aurora, rife with artists all over the place. No art center in East Aurora. Barbara donated the money to have the second floor of the Roycroft Campus print shop transformed into the Castilia Art Center. It has all the equipment, we have lockers, we have, eventually we'll have pottery here, we'll have all kinds of other things as we expand. Executive Director Kurt Moranto says all are welcome. We have artists who are retiring, we have artists that are new, fledgling, and they can come and meet uh, together. According to Kurt, what people find most surprising is the price of membership. We're like, oh, it's only $50 a month? No, no, you know, a year, that's it. Photographer Robert Barr creates his artistry with an old-fashioned camera. The lens is a John B. Dahlmeyer um, patent portrait 3B lens made in London in 1891. Robert will be doing workshops here at the Castilia Art Center. Oh, don't mind me, I'm just having my picture taken the old-fashioned way. <laughs> just hold your pose and stare at one spot. Yeah. Whether you're a newbie or a pro, the Castilia Art Center is a picture-perfect place to create your next masterpiece. They can watch another artist doing something and say suddenly, hmm, you know what, I can do that. Barbara says that Albert Hubbard, the man who started the arts and crafts movement, would have approved. He would think it's a great continuation of what he started. Mike Randall, 7 News. East Aurora.